natural language processing application. The vast amount of data on web and social media have made it possible to make new fantastic applications of natural language processing. Here we discuss some of the common applications of natural language processing. In the previous video, we have discussed about the objective of natural language processing and what are the various tasks involved in natural language processing. Now we discuss about what are some common applications. These are some common applications of natural language processing. Knowingly or unknowingly, we are getting benefit of these kind of activities in our day-to-day -day life. These are some normal real-life applications I have quoted here. In Google, when we type natural, it automatically gives us predictions of next word. And when we type column digit, we can see here some spelling mistake. Google asks, did you mean column digit? And here, when we type natural language processing, we saw some spelling mistakes. And Google showing us, showing the result of natural language processing instead of natural language processing we have typed. And in Word, we can see when we type something, if it has some grammatical error or some spelling mistake, we get some red color underline. And when we type there, we can see some suggestions or actual words. Now, every information is at our fingertip. We can search anything on search engine. We are very commonly using Google. Here, how this information retrieval happens? When we type some query, it has to understand the important words in the query and then it has to match with the repository of document and it has to display some matching document. This all relates with natural language understanding and processing. Machine translation. We are translating a text from a source language to a target language. This is fully automatic. Here, this is a snapshot of Google Translator. Using the Google Translator, we can talk non-native languages. Question answering. One of the oldest NLP tasks. In information retrieval, we are getting a list of documents that get matches with our coding. In case of question answering, we can we either get the actual answer of the question or we get a short descriptive paragraph related to the question. Question answering automatically answers questions posed by humans in natural language. Apple, Siri, Google Assistant, Amazon Alexa are some commonly using virtual assistants. When we have some particular question, we can use these applications to get that answer. Information extraction is the task of automatically extracting structured information from a document. Here, Barack Obama elected as US president. We need to get, we need to extract about person, position or event. This kind of information we have to extract. Person, who is person here? Barack Obama. Position, President of US. Event, election. Consider this email entry. Hey, I'm only in class 4 AI is scheduled on 6 6 2020 at 9.30 AM. We are required to construct or create a calendar entry automatically. Having field, event. Only in class, subject, AI, time, 9.30 AM and day 6 is 2020. Sentiment analysis is one of the emerging applications of natural language processing. Sentiment analysis or opinion mining is to interpret and classify emotions like positive, negative or neutral. On what data we can perform sentiment analysis? Commonly, sentiment analysis is performing on comments and tweets also on reviews. From product reviews or social media messages, task is to mine the sentiment. Twitter sentiment analysis is a modern way of election result prediction, also identifying suitable candidates for election. 
when we try to install some application we always checks for some reviews and we more, many times we have gone through such kind of review here by reading this comment totally dissatisfied with the service worst customer care ever from this tweet or review we can understand the emotion as negative brilliant effort guys loved your work from this in from this tweet we can understand the emotion as positive thank you for your lovely face mask this review is considered as a positive review document classification classify document to any or no any of the particular class for that we have to understand the contents in the document then we need to classify the document into either sports arts history science so on so forth dialog system is another application of natural language processing chatbot simulates human conversation through voice or text many chatbots are available in the industry some common chatbots are customer service chatbot e-commerce chatbot health medical chatbots etc this customer service chatbot answers common questions from online shoppers also assist them for purchasing here we can see some examples of chatbot i have quoted some chatbot from of lic you can see here this is another kind of visual chatbot where we can upload image and we can ask questions related to this image another application of natural language processing is summarization or text summarization this process is to identify the most important information from a text automatic text summarization is the task of producing a concise and fluent summary while preserving key information content and overall meaning here we we can see on application in shorts now nowadays we commonly use this application to read news form detection is a very common application of machine learning through natural language processing from an email we have to identify whether it is spam spam detection is used to detect unwanted emails getting into users inbox to speech as well as speech to text are very common applications of natural language processing it is used in applications such as mobile assistance home automation voice user interfaces and so on speech recognition is used for converting spoken words into text this the already mentioned chatbots also with ways to identify the spoken 